Hi, I'm Shannon Gavin Johnson, the director of Legacy Museum on Main, and this is a brief moment in LaGrange's history. Willie Howell Fuller, LaGrange's first connection to the Tuskegee Airmen, was born in Tarboro, North Carolina in 1919. He enrolled in Tuskegee Institute in Alabama, where he received a bachelor's degree in mechanical industries in science. Pearl Harbor was attacked in December of 1941 while he was a student. Fuller enlisted in the United States Army Air Corps on March 16, 1942 at Tuskegee for the duration of the war or other emergency, plus six months. He became a fighter pilot for the now famous Tuskegee Airmen, the first company of African-American military aviators. He flew 76 combat missions. He helped liberate islands in the Mediterranean, for which he was awarded the Air Medal with Oak Leaf Clusters for heroic and meritorious achievement. Having married Miss Willie Ruth Dunson of LaGrange, they settled here in her hometown. He opened and operated the first black-owned taxicab business in LaGrange and also taught civilian pilot training. He was active in the Boy Scouts and became the executive of the Negro Division of the West Georgia Council of Boy Scouts of America. In 1960, he accepted a position of Scout Executive for the South Florida Council. Mr. Fuller died in 1995 and was buried in Miami. Mrs. Fuller died in 2006 and is buried with him. To learn more about the contributions African Americans have made to our country, visit Legacy Museum on Main. This has been a brief moment in LaGrange's history.